the, the man you just watched his video, does he look familiar? Yes. I have seen him before with uh, uh, Bedukobi. You have seen him together with Prophet Bedukobi? In fact, um, I'm sorry, but I feel it is very heavy in my mouth to call Bedukobi a prophet. A prophet. True. Okay. Sincerely, it is not that I'm okay. doing it. Okay. I just feel some check in my throat to call Bedukobi a prophet. Wow. Every time I try, it doesn't come. It doesn't come. Well, me pacho. Your papa ni ni din komo yin. Aye, papa your friend Eduardo Domingo. Na ye bo video ya. Don't you why di friend waka se unim. So me say we check in your mini pe be our time, papa. It either say he is jealous of papa, and I say he has a hidden political affiliation. Ah, a nunti or person who attack him, papa. Yes. Now, Ernest. Papa, do you want to come there? Yes. All right. What, what do you have to say? You see, when I met uh, uh, Bedukobi, mm -hmm. Pastor Ben can testify to this. Mm -hmm. When two, uh, 320 ml, mm -hmm. the car he bought with my money, mm -hmm. which was his first car, mm -hmm. which he paid for with my money, mm -hmm. when we were going, when we were driving, the car was having DVL, isn't it? DVL. Yeah, DVL. DVL. So, everywhere we go, he has to tell the police there's some logbook. Mm -hmm. You know, he has to show them some yeah, logbook. to log in. To log in. And then this guy will say that, yeah, I am the ritual president of mm -hmm. Ghana. That, that's what he says. Always, everywhere we met police. And he would bribe them. You understand? Who, who was saying that? Bedukobi, of course. That he's a spiritual president. Yes. And he, uh, uh, Pastor Ben, his assistant pastor Ben, can testify whenever you see him, that Bedukobi always says that uh, President Akufuado, mm -hmm. when he becomes president, mm -hmm. he is going to give him the national flag of Ghana mm -hmm. in front of his car mm -hmm. with a different uh, with a plate license, uh, license plate. Mm -hmm. To show that he is the nation's prophet. That is what he was saying. This is in where I can see this is leading to. Mm. Now, it, be, it did not become the nation's prophet. Mm. Incidentally, it was rather Reverend Member that is known as the nation prophet here. Mm. But this is the biggest ambition of Bedu Kobe. True. Mm. Every day he says it. You can ask this Pastor Ben, his assistant, then. Mm -hmm. Who will confirm to you that Bedukobi's greatest ambition is to be the nation's prophet? He will tell the police when they stop us, he said, I am the nation's prophet. He still bribed them because he has not loved them. Mm. You understand? Mm. He will give them bribe. Mm. But I know that how he will put a flag of Ghana authorized by the government, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Now, I know where the whole thing is coming from now, because mm. that's the biggest ambition of Bedu Kobe. And as this Pastor Ben, his assistant then, he will tell you that Bedu Kobe has boasted a thousand times of being the nation's prophet. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Domingo, how close were you with him? Because you are talking about the fact that Bedu Kobe you were in does, a car together. Bedu Kobe does not sleep until he draws me at 2 a.m. So that nobody, and he has won all the, pro, all the pastors. If he sees any one of them at my door, he's going away. And Bedukobi comes and gives me account of how he has paid all the pastors. Mm. Not knowing the only pastor he pays is Pastor Ben. Mm. Now, it was uh, this Pastor Donadoni, mm -hmm. the tall, heavy guy, mm -hmm. who invited me to his uh, anniversary, one year anniversary. Mm -hmm. It was then he was saying that Bedu Kobe, for all the five years he was there as an apprentice, never paid him a cent. <coughs> Whereas Bedu Kobe come to me, say, Bedu Kobe was sleeping with Hagar. The girl, I don't know whether it's the family of the wife, <coughs> he was sleeping with Hagar. And when they want to have an app appointment, mm -hmm. he said, I will be there, and he'll be telling his wife, I'm with Mr. Domingo. So that satisfies the wife. People are saying that Bedukobi's wife pray. Bedukobi's wife, look, there is no armed robber whose wife doesn't know the job of the husband. Mm. Mm. Bedukobi's wife is a devil incarnate, and they are together. 
He knows, he knows that. It's my money they used to pay for her to go to uh, school. Mr. Domingo, do you have, you've been talking of money, money. Do you have an, some kind of money with him? You mean Bill Kobe? Yeah. In millions. Millions of, of, yes, of CDs? Yes, about of two million dollars. Two million dollars. See this how? Even as I'm talking now, I don't work in, in Ghana. My office is at uh, Delaware and in, in Europe also. Mm. Delaware in the USA. But how did that two million dollars get to him? I heard there is a chap, you know, there's a woman very close to him. Mm. So I, I learned that he's his girlfriend, but the woman wanted to be my girlfriend. Okay. So she told me that you, you don't know. You don't know that all your containers have been sold by Bedou Kobe. There is this boy called uh, Kwesi Akwesi. If you enter Bedou Kobe's church, when you stand from the altar, you will see that this shortest guy mm -hmm. is fair in color. Mm -hmm. So I know him. He has gone to rent a shop at Obasi Okai mm -hmm. to be selling my spare parts. Mm -hmm. But I didn't care about spare parts, mm -hmm. actually. Mm -hmm. They tell they give me a recommendation what I should bring down for them. Mm -hmm. So I was bringing down for them. He sold all. But then he will come to me and say he's giving an account. I have paid all the debt of the church. I have paid. That's the account he will give me. Mm. That day he has smoked weed like. Who has smoked? Who has smoked? Weed? Bedukobi has smoked what? We have. I don't know. We have smoked before. Is it that you had the scent or you? you... Yeah, from his mouth. He, came, he, he was drunk too. So it's a mixture of drink and weed. So he was telling me that, uh, sir, he called me sir, that he calls me sir. Mm -hmm. So he told me that, sir, I have come to give you account. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. I've been seeing account, not by mouth, that he has paid all the debt of the church. That's how he's accounting for my money mm -hmm. he, he took. So. One day he stood in front of the church and told them that we are buying a gold land and we are going to use Mr. Domingo's uh, technology. That's what I ordered, the machine. He doesn't know why I want to use the machine. He doesn't know the process I want to go through. He went and collected money from all the church members, said that they should sh buy shares you know, for the machine. Mm. Now that night he came and told me, as a matter of fact, it was obnoxious. We plus drink. In the mouth of a, a, a reverend minister. Mm. So I said, okay, no problem. I found also that he will give, we plan, he, he, he organized some meeting which business people in the church are supposed to come and, you know, get together so mm. we can help them. But that was my purpose of church. Mm. Because you see, I look at the church. After service, my wife then would take many of the church people come to the house to come and collect rice, oil, and things. I say that no, this cannot be. Uh, I mean, uh, praise and worship to God. God is not happy about hungry people shouting and jumping. Mm. What we must be doing as a church is a kind of community to improve the life of the people. Mm. You will see that praise and worship will work. So this is the basis of what I start to finance, put money in Mr. Kobe's hand. But in the end, when the woman told me that he had sold a lot of things, and this woman, he was sleeping with both of them. Mm. So Hagar, the girl who runs the shop mm -hmm. in the outside the church, Hagar lives with Bodu Kobe. Maybe today, uh, Gloria will kill Bodu Kobe if he hears. I confirm that. Because he was sleeping with Gloria. So one day, that Gloria became uncontrollable. He misbehaved to me. She misbehaved to me. And I said, Who is the Gloria? And Gloria, the I don't know whether it's family of Bilko, but he, she lives with them okay. at that time. And Hagar is the different one in the scene, apart from the Gloria. Yeah, Gloria so is the wife. Okay, Gloria is the wife. Okay. Hagar is a family member, something like that. That is with them. Because when Hagar, and I told him that, look, if that girl comes to your church, I will never step into the church again. Bidukobi came to my house. I have a very, at the house, I have a very big 
uh, toilet, uh, you know, uh, uh, suck away. Mm -hmm. That is the uh, septic tank. Mm -hmm. And you can even see the way they make it on it in the evening. Mm -hmm. He knelt down and started weeping. Bedukobi. He was weeping, begging me not to take that decision. Mm -hmm. So I look at this guy, Kura. Is it? Uh, that's my Kura. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is he actually a pastor? Mm -hmm. Because he smokes weed and he doesn't sleep. I'm telling you, Body Kobe, today, if I'm lying, point me out. You have no, you can't eat proper meal. You can't eat. Mm. You cannot sleep. Mm. Your peace of mind has gone. I don't need to curse you, but I've cursed you because I know that God has cursed you. Whenever I see you, I see the animal that controls you mm. with horns mm. every time you start, sit in front of me. So this man drinks human blood. Who? Cool. So I'm going to show you a video very soon. Then we'll come back to where you end up. But your video now, Papa Cass will be in the truth will continually be true. So I want you to watch this video. Then we'll come back to you. Okay. But your video number. I believe, sir. Mamma <laughs> And you also been papa in the beam. A free day cream. Soften a friend of a ducobino. And yet, soft also been pa a bat and in the beam. And yet, and then soft also been pa beam. The entire yammy ban in the beam, no. The cassatana won't ye. Nanya trend and in tongue. No, then also I will run here maybe more. Me ni nyo mwa. Nti mi nti mi. Em fana ebe bi. Me kaso wa dinu huwa ugra ni emu miyo. Me kaso wa kwa kwa ye bi bi. Ana wa kwa jwa ni bi bi. Ba. E kwa bi ni kwa fwa bi yonu oma namu. E nunti mi nti mi. Em fana nye be bi. E fri se. E wi a si a ye wei. E se che mo nyo kwa na mi nchilo usubayi. E nu mwa mwa takra se lu mwtu bu mwa. So papa no obi na papa ne kasa chira o na untie kasa chira na untie ya ne je so mpe ne ja e ka se so fu pani bi e so ba radio so be ka se so fu bi nya ne ba o kan the plane se na ye ne ba no no ba se se nya me bi a wo ye nti so so fu no nya ne ba bi nti me sere mo nya me nko e na metu mri a obi ntu bi da mi ni ma so fu bebrebe ya o mo ma Enti o masem, o mama fak enbiso, inti o me deny o mama, e o sun sun, inti sofu be di kobi, o nyami be bi e o sun sun, ya kase o mwa de ya, e kwen biso na no krebi kolos, sa o mfe buoni e ni di e ma o sun sun e jade ya, e ni o mwa de ya, o mwa sun sun e jana akoto koto, o papa, na so so na ya, non se so u gwa di u. Obono mo be koto koto aso 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 nine anda fon kra ma o se na na koma e jina ho kra chen enu ti no enye ni pa act e na chese o bere no ho ase obi ono beti mi afi wa no esu no oyi wa ma se judas on so for be a friend of be do i believe sir mo mo ha de obi ate nkan na so no sa komo na na so ni di at the glorious way. Now, our papa name. Okay, so that was Prophet Isaac Osu Um, I don't know if your papa Eduardo Domingo saw this video anywhere, but quite a fast on papa Benya was a bit surprised. All this while, Prophet Isaac Osu has been harboring this, some of these things. Thinking, say, I am a back and listen to him. Go, I say, 
but it was a bit strange so you are talking about the fact that he cannot eat he cannot sleep he drinks blood somebody's even asking that with the weed is it that you 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 just sense it or you saw him doing something like that we, we can okay and i caught him with you caught Jowlu. him at yes. Jowlu. and he said to me he just smiled he said you know we have to pepper sometimes yes. and if anybody doubts my story about Beduko, ask oima messi ask the husband ask tabita kum i told him to be giving tabita kum money when he was in trouble he doesn't give him as much as I asked him to give him, because the man had trouble. He planned with me that we should buy the house of Tabitha Kuhn, which he wants to use for hotel. But he was an evil man. Okay, I'm saying, you ask all the church members at that time. He cannot deny, because he knows they will know that he's a registered criminal if he denies. Everybody in the church knew. He Medu Kobe brought some pastors, just like this uh, Obutu. Obutu. Yeah, what they do when they come to the church, somebody will take their Bible, march them in front. There are plenty there. He gives them money every week because they come there on Sundays. They all know. They beg, uh, they beg Medu Kobe. This pastor beg Medu Kobe, please give us one of your rich people so that they can support us. Mm. He came and told me. Now, to let us be very vital in the issue we are discussing, how I, when I met Bedu Kobe, mm. he took me with Oima Messi's car to somewhere along the Spintis Road. And just from uh, Sakumano, down about uh, 1,000 meters, and then we turned right into a, a a very rough road and he said that this is the house he was given before mm -hmm. this house is where he was living but the man who gave him the house he, he he saw vividly that the wife is a witch and told the man and so the man sacked them and i told him i said what are you waiting for you have money now you have been selling things so why, what's your problem he said no problem he will rent a house but we went to the house to pick up his brick and brats to pick up uh, his, uh, what do you call it, the plugs, the extension board, we went to pick them up with him. I entered the place, nice big sitting room. If the man who gave Bedu Kobe his first house along Spintest Road is hearing, you told your wife that you don't like these pastors and you don't like to go to their church. Mm. But the wife dragged the man to the church. Mm. Now, when the man came home, Bedukobi thought that the man, you see, most of the people they see men, they think they are the breadwinners mm. or their wealth belongs to them from the beginning. Mm. But there's a woman always mm. behind. So he did not know the setup. He wanted to seize, but that's his style. He wanted to seize the man from the family. Okay, so we are. As I said, mm. if you think that what I'm saying about Bedukobi, is for certain expediency, political, or selfish. I have no bro I have no business with Bene Kobe. Since all this matter came out, some of his members have called me. I should come and visit them. I told them that unless they want trouble, mm. I will not visit them. But then, when we went to the place, we came back and I told him, oh, the next thing was that he rented a house. Everybody in the church knew near uh, these uh, houses of the MPs at Sakumana. He rented the place. I haven't heard that armed robbers attacked him there, but he was not in. Now, that was the first house he rented because he took me to the house of the girl where he was sleeping. He has nowhere to lay his head. Mm. He said to me that the father, of, you know, to get my sympathy, the father of this girl have to go to sleep before he can enter the house to sleep in the girl's room. And then he asked me to thank the girl for him because he was feeling really heavily high by driving and 320 ml, you understand? And the girl was seeing him and was 
praising that oh God has done things you know for him then after that Bidukubi got that house he was stealing the wife will cook uh, fufu as I mean he says specially for me I will eat too because I knew that at that time Bidukubi can never think of killing me but I did not know that he's a killer too at that time but I did not know that that is his modus operandi. That is the way he operates. I didn't know that. I thought that the the man just got angry that he called his wife a witch. But he told me himself, nobody, if you want to argue it, ask him. He told me himself. But at that time, I did not know that is the way he operates. Now, I start to understand gradually when the money started to come into bed. That time, because Kobe was prophesying like God himself. You know his prophecy? All the boys come to my house because I help them. All the boys he uses to go, they will look at you. That time, because he, went, he went and made a, a glass, which, you know, As in the way he prophesies yes. in church. In church. Okay. I will tell you the prophecy. All right. It's about cars only. Mm. Every time, somebody... Uh, his pastor Ben knew that somebody will look at the car that come in, the person that came in, they jot it down then they will follow the person to where he's sitting down. Dan also do the job a lot. So when Medikobi is watching you cannot see him. At first it was darkness before they put the glass. When Medikobi uh, when he's looking at you he sees that Dan is behind you and that makes a signal that you are the person with car number so and so. Mm. So, after he has collected the car numbers very well, and some know about the people, some bring them, and they give them details about the, about the life of the people. So when Bidukubi come around, he will look, he will pass you. Mm. Yeah, he's, he's a dramatist, mm -hmm. a great actor. So <laughs> he will go and come back and look at you like this. And then you say, come, 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 come out. Hey, I'm seeing car number GL. So, 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 so. He has killed his, he has killed his interpreter, who's called Apia. Apia will say, bonsen, 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 bonsen. They will all clap for car numbers. So, in other words, the person that was at the top of the building. Is Bedukobi. That is looking to the looking, glass. So, it's Bacon. That's mm -hmm. the man he, he sent behind mm -hmm. to locate the person. For him, so he can see you very well. Mm. So when the person stand in front of you, with the card number they are, they are giving him, mm -hmm. he has marked it down. If you change your seat, they will also update him. Wow. So he was prophesying. <laughs> he told me one day that Prophet Ophel Bepa asked him, that son of man, you are prophesying very much these days. What is the secret? He was telling you that, that was prophet Isaac was being asked Ask him. That was the secret of his prophecy. So uh, I say, uh, is that supposed to be a secret? Mm. Yes, I mean. Mm. So all this while, did you know the things he, would, he was doing? And if you did, did no, you the believe first, in? No, the first thing I saw is that he tried to call my spirit. He fell down and nailed into his head. Who? Mirukobi. In a dream. No, Philly, Philly, in the in the in, in his in his uh, church. No, behind that where they are staying. He fell. He fell down, hit his head against a nail. Because, you know, at that time he thought he was working. If I am, uh, uh, what what do you call it? This uh, fried yam, mm -hmm. I will have fried to to, to drop by now. Because Bedukobi used to bathe me with almost a gallon of uh, uh, what's the name? Oil. Oil. And he said he wanted some good oil from Spain. I told my people there to ship plenty to him. Not knowing that Bedukobi used to pour the oil into empty bottles. So he has a lot of empty bottles. Why we tell them that, hey, who has the oil there? And then people will rush up and down. They'll be buying the oil from the store. The oil which I bought for him. But these are virgin oil. Mm -hmm. They are not uh, just mixed uh, uh, olive oil. Mm -hmm. So, he will be selling the oil. 
That's not, even I don't I don't count that one because it's, it's the work of God because we're doing it. We thank God for being be and learned about God. When we are seeking God, but in seeking God, you can meet with a lot of problems. Mm -hmm. I mean? Because is the pastor I I was so close to, we have we share the same office. But the rooms which he uses where his idol is, that room for me if you leave me here. I will just sit down. I will I'm not inquisitive. I don't want to know many things. I believe that the man you know me today can be your downfall. It can be your misery. Mm. That is why I'm not interested in meeting or something like that. I don't join clubs. I don't. When I finish my work, I'm at home. So, this man is a very inquisitive man. KK. That room that I made a point of not ever entering, he went and entered it. The next Sunday was KK dancing like a, a, a crazy man. Who was KK to him in that? He, he, he says he's a pastor now. He's a pastor now. So, so after that, entering that room, he go crazy. He got crazy. Yes. You are you were witness to it. That is the office I sit down with. But Kobe, we work together there. Wow. Wow. And that is the room. But I never entered the room, never. But this guy is very inquisitive. He went and oh, entered the room. Maybe want to become powerful like. <laughs> he got madness in the process. So now the men that the have been committing, I know that most of us who were in his church during my time, almost all of them have died. Mr. Eduardo, these are serious allegations that I'm telling you. I, I say I noticed. Okay, you noticed. That's right. allegation. All right. But the one I'm saying that he killed the man. He confessed it himself. Done. He said it himself. He poisoned him. Oh, he told the top member, anybody who challenges him will go the dance way. He will kill him. He killed them. He told the congregation. Mm. I'm not alleging. Mm. That's why I said that allegation is different from fact. That's right. You know, legal matters in Africa here, they carry things too far. These lawyers, one of them are not up to scratch. You will see a video of a data, a fact, and you go to court and judges will be accepting that it's allegation. How can Philly, we call it Philly Philly, mm -hmm. how can video be an allegation? They should respond that nonsense from the law. They will be making case for a fact and calling it allegation. Mm. Where is that allegation coming from? So, I want to really cut it up a bit.